Okay, so we're going to reduce expenditure on uh, research some more. I mean, we are... it is at the, the right amount for the items we're researching, but I don't have all that much money. I think the, the level we're about to do, we may get may get to uh, may, may get to scale or, or raid a vault, steal some credits or raid a vault. Uh, but we'll see. I don't think this one's too hard. It's a bit tricky, though. Is the thing. Wow, okay, that was impressive. How did we take out a police car? Four shots. That, that was literally four shots, wasn't it? I'm not wrong there, am I? Spot the random civilian, oh sorry, ra random agents in clone shields. on top bitch. Okay. Well, I actually managed to persuade her. Sorry, persuade her and then guided. Okay. Wow, okay, my bad. I like the I think what's happening there is they're getting to the uh the end zone and completing a mission. But then the agents are dropping bombs just after they get there. Uh so after they died the mission's completed. After the agents died the mission's completed, but then because they've dropped their bombs they then blow up all the cultists <laughs> uh, and all the civilians the cultists have persuaded which isn't good, which isn't good but yeah, okay, we got through that mission okay, might be able to get some more money there don't know how well this one's gonna go uh, can't even really remember this mission I think well, I remember it on the syndicate side. Don't remember what it plays like on the church side though. Do you need more med kits? We do need more med kits now. It's one of those things I always forget. Wow, okay, that's cool. Uh, let's 
Okay for this one then. Oh, okay, so we're getting a lift, apparently. Uh, so our target's over here at the moment, with a lot of agents. He will be moving over here. God damn, look at all these guys. Can we uh, group here? Yeah. Let's see what we can do. It's going to be plopping down, plopping uh, right at the top. Let's see if we can't. maybe uh, draw them all out. Can we do it like this? Or is he just going to run away? I don't know if he's just going to get like straight on the shuttle now though. That's the thing. God damn, look how many of them, many of them are there. And they're heavily armed as well, well armoured. God, and they're still coming. It's like every single guard is coming down. This isn't going to work, is it? He's going to get on the shuttle before we can kill them all. Oh, okay, no, he's just in the building. So if we can rush up, I uh, should be able to just get him as he comes out of the building. Possibly. It's that guy, right? So should we try and get some agents or Are there any? Oh, okay, yeah, there are. There are just agents. Um, are there enough civilians? That's saying. Yes. Okay. Okay, we're gonna do that then. Uh, gonna need to wipe out all these, uh, all these militia first, though. I don't know if uh, triggering the militia might trigger the agents to attack us as well. We'll have to see. I wonder how their health works. Like, if they take two shots to kill, like. If I left them for long enough, would their health regenerate? Or is it like mine does? Because I've got mods. 
or is it just permanent? It's interesting. So how else is there to kill? Um, so there's nobody over here. It's actually in the Syndicate campaign. You you do this level much later on, uh, but there's like a meeting between church, uh, church zealots and uh, corporations at the at that end of the map where I was, uh, and it's just completely empty on the church version. Similar mission though. I think you had to assassinate somebody. Was it that? Uh, it was possibly Disaxo actually. It's been a while since I played the Syndicate campaign, so I can't can't remember everything. Or even most of it. Damn, look how quickly his health goes up. And that is because of the level 3 body. <laughs> you guys, you guys gonna come and party, eh? Oh, okay, there we go. You're into the group thing. Oh, okay, well, he's fast. He's a quick one. I like that there's just a random civilian in the shuttle as well. This is a space shuttle, by the way. I didn't show this off today. Uh, I presume that's the pilot or the astronaut, or whoever flies the uh, the the shuttle. Sorry. Wondering uh, how many civilians I should try and get. I mean, really, this should be enough. Okay, that's two. Can I let my bar recharge actually? 
just to give me enough, uh, as much of a chance as possible. I don't think these guys actually move. Oh, they've all got blonde hair as well, that's weird. I don't think these guys actually move uh, very quickly. Like, they don't react unless you're actually within striking distance. So you can take out each team individually if you're careful, I think. And that just leaves one guy. And we are going to steal a car as well, just in case. Oh, I need that item as well, don't I? I imagine that's probably an epidermis, but still. This building's not going to explode when I go in it, is it? Hooray! That's a surprise. Pleasant surprise. So we just need to get back to the IML and make sure we aren't... Uh, we don't get stuck in any geometry. Um, interesting to note, they do blockade the road. I think that's pretty cool. They, they put cars in front of it to block off your path, which is a neat little uh, vis a visual touch. Obviously it doesn't affect us when we're just playing as agents, but still it looks pretty cool. Yeah, do I actually need any of these? Do I actually need to research any of these? That's the thing. Uh... Oh, level 3 legs now. That's new. We're getting there, we're getting there, ever so slowly. Yeah, that's pretty uh, dark. We're getting towards the the more disturbing. Uh, is it an aphorism? I forget what you call it when it's like a sort of like a biblical quote. They're getting a bit darker. And it's becoming. A, they're hinting at that the uh, the uh, uh, the church isn't as as utopian as it appears. Well, not that it really appears that a utopian, but still. So I think, like, it's a bit vague actually, but it's just a mission where you have to kill them. Um, we can get some money in this one. There's like a guy carrying a case, I think he's got money in it. Uh, other than that, we're just gonna... And there is a battle tank we can use as well. Other than that, we're just gonna kill people. We'll just have a, we'll plant them there and just have a quick look. So yeah, this is similar to how the Syndicate mission went. I uh, think in that one you're fighting unguided plus the, the uh, rival Syndicate. But here the, the road is blockaded. Uh, and then there's just lots and lots of uh, agents about. Okay, I was just thinking, I, I was going to 
Did they just run off? They literally just run off. Okay. Is he in the car? Trying to figure out where the finance executive is. Oh, okay, is he in the... Did I miss him? Oh no, there he is. Or what's left of him. So I was going to say, like, I, I've, I was feeling bad because I wanted to take down the bridge to take out some of these guys. But I don't have launchers, I haven't bought launchers yet. But then they've given me a tank, so I'm just going to use that. Oh, I only think it fires one rocket at a time, or one missile, so that's not so good. But still, one, one missile is better than no missiles. Wow, this thing is slow. I'm just going to park like right there. What are you guys doing? I think if we take down the fence that should take down the IML. I know that doesn't make any sense but it's the way the physics logic works in this game for buildings. Hey. Could have just planted a bomb really, can I? Is this working? I don't think this is working. That's a really strong fence. Oh, okay, no, that didn't work. Um, you know what? Let's just plant a bomb. I apologise, that wasn't the most exciting viewing. And we need to get a very, very, very long distance away. Oh dear. It's worth it just because of how hilarious that is. Ready. How much damage it does as well, bloody hell. Like, that's not realistic. Like, I know it will hurt and do damage, but the fact it killed all those people and blew up those cars just seems a bit ridiculous to me. Oh, okay, they've got launchers. I thought I'd have to buy some, but now I can just use the ones to uh, pick up from some of these guys. Oh, I guess there's only a few of them have launchers. Let us see though. That guy has a launcher. Uh. Gonna kill this guy. Make sure we've all got launchers. Selected. Okay. Yeah. Selected. I don't even have to go anywhere. They're all coming to me as well. I love when they do this, like you, you can just sit there, bloody hell, that is a lot of guys. Uh, and they just like, 
they line up to to come and attack you? Or are they coming in procession to attack you? And you can just take them out. Just stand in a line and take them out. God damn, look at all of that destruction. Okay. And there's like three guys left. Okay. We are doing well. <laughs> We're not going to get ambushed, are we? Because that would be a bitch. I love the little docks as well. Like, that looks so cool. You know, Syndicate Wars gets a lot of shit for not being as original as the first game, like it's groundbreaking. But then it... It did... Like visually it did do a lot of interesting things, like it did... They did put a lot of effort into making... Even though the levels are very co cookie cutter... Uh, they did put a lot of effort into making the game... Or the levels seem like cities. Putting little details in everywhere, which is nice. I really appreciate that. This is going surprisingly well. What what what's happening here? What have I done wrong? Where is my multiple ambushes? This isn't how the game works. God damn, look at that destruction. Okay. So we did get 200,000, but we still spent more than we gained, right? Oh, and a Billy mission. Oh, that's good. I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Billy mission. We're almost there. Almost. That's pretty good anyway, they've all got... I guess I can sell these now actually, they've all got... Uh, they, they've all got launchers, they've all got long range rifles, uh, auto med kits and clang shields. It's good progress. <laughs> 